Hi, hi everyone, it's Jill. I'm here with my Stitch Fix number seven, Winter Edition. So, let's just dive right in. Um, for those of you that don't know what Stitch Fix is, it is a subscription site. You pay 20 bucks for a styling fee. The styling fee does get applied to the end of your order um, if you decide to keep everything. Um, if you don't decide to keep nothing, then you are out $20. And really, you take a pretty extensive style quiz and they um, style you from there. Um, every fix does come with this cute little card. Um, and it has a little note from your stylist along with all the items in there and ways to style it. A stylist, uh, my stylist has been Lindsay a couple times now. Um, the last time I did this, um, she did a pretty darn good job. So I am excited to see what we have today. Um, I did open the box already and right away there is a bag. Um, I am a self-proclaimed bag hoarder. <laughs> I love bags. Bags look great on everyone. It doesn't matter how big you are, how small you are, nothing. Bags are amazing. Um, this one is called, uh, let me put on my shoe here. This one is called an Octavia Oriana Double Zip Work Satchel. <laughs> so you're kind of losing, <laughs> losing me at work because I do work a little part time here, um, but. I don't necessarily have a real job, but guys, this bag's pretty cool. I feel like you could use it for other things. Um, it has two like zip pockets, which are super fun. Um, they, I can see why that would be for work. And then the middle would be like just an open pocket with a longer strap. It's in the color burgundy. Um, so it's kind of fun, it zips both, so you can like really store some good stuff in there, right? Like, and then it ha I mean, it just has a lot of fun little pockets. So like I said, this is the Octavia, this is the Octavia Oriana Double Zip Work Special, and it's $58, which is um, more than I normally pay for a bag because I'm cheap, but, and I have so many, and I can't justify having a bunch of expensive ones, but $58 is really not that bad, and it's pretty cute. So, I mean, if anything, I'll, I can always fall back on the bag, right? Like, can't go wrong. So, next item is a Heartloom um, Langley Plaid Poncho. <sighs> I know this is like a super hot like item and it's like super in style i am just not a huge fan of them for myself i think that the problem is i don't know i need to try it on it's super cute though because um it's like plaid and just adorable but it's and it's like a pretty heavy weight which would be perfect for the winter here but i just don't know i'm not a huge poncho lover for myself. I think other people are always like adorable in them, but I just don't know. Next item is a uh, Ink Love and Peace um, Cal and Cal Knit Pullover in green. Um, this is super cute. It's kind of a lightweight um, like cotton sweatshirt material and then it has like these cute little pockets and then it has a cinch drawstring. And it is $64. This is a pink clover Aisha knit top in gray. So it's just a basic little knit top. And then um, it has a sleeve detail where it looks like you have another little shirt under it and it looks like you can tie them even. So that's fun, different. And it was $40. And then the last item I received is some Liverpool Jacqueline skinny pants. Um, these are $78. That's a lot, but they're black, which is fun. And I have another pair of Liverpool pants that I actually really like the fit of, so I'm excited to try these on. 
And again, they are $78 and they're just a black skinny jean. So I am going to go try all this stuff out. So the first items I threw on are the Liverpool jeans. And they're just a basic black, but they're actually like a really nice soft um, flowy material. So I had to cut my head off and so you can see my jeans. <laughs> um, so it's like a, the material's nice and they have a nice stretchy fill, but like they don't feel like they'd be falling down all the time. Um, the only thing I don't love is they don't have front pockets. That's weird a little bit, but it has back pockets, so it's fine. This item is the pink clover um, gray knit top. So this top is fine. Um, it's just kind of basic, like it's just a brown top, like, or brown. It's just a gray top. And then with these like sleeves, which are a cute detail, but I don't, it's, it's fine. Um, it's fine. <laughs> I don't know that I absolutely love it, but I don't not love it, so we're gonna need some help there. Um, it's just, it's fine. Like, it's a nice length. Um, the material's a nice lightweight, um, like, sweater material, so it'd be great for the winter polish. And this is a fun little detail, but... I don't know. <laughs> what do you guys think? I am going to throw on the other top and the poncho. <laughs> okay, so here I have on the Heartloom poncho and then the Ink Love shirt, um, Callum Mike shirt. Um, I want to love ponchos. Like, they're so cute on everyone else. My, I don't know. I think that my thing is, is like, I'm already almost six foot tall, and I'm not petite in any way, and so I always feel like they're, with them being so bulky, they make me look so much bigger. Like, I get the, like, I get why you would like them, like they're super cozy, like you can, like, they're like, you can, it's like wearing a blanket, like who wouldn't want to wear a blanket and be warm and cozy, right? Like in the winter and, but like, at the same time it's like wearing a blanket, so like, is it, is it the good thing? Like, does it make me look bulkier? Like I just feel like it's so big, like, I mean, it's a blanket, which that's the point, right? Like you're wearing a blanket, a poncho is a blanket. Um, I love that it's like sewed on the side, like that's a fun little detail. It doesn't actually like go over your head, it's like an actual cardigan type style. And I mean, it's warm and cozy, but it's like, it's bulky. It's like wearing a blanket, I don't know, what do you guys think? Um, Kalmuk shirt. I really love it. I love the material. The sleeves are long. Like they have the fun thumb holes. I just am really into the Kalmuk stuff with the pockets. You could wear it for like every day as a sweatshirt. You can wear it to work out in. Like it is just super cute, super comfy. Um, the sleeves are good. It has this fun little cinch waist down here, so I suppose you could like cinch it up to be. Tighter or looser, I'm not really, like would you cinch it up to like layer it, I'm not really sure. I think it's just a fun little detail. Um, it's just really my dream. So this one's a definite win. And then I still have on the jeans. Um, I wanted to wear them for a minute. They are staying in place, which I really like. So they might be a win too, but let's recap real quick. Um, so here's a quick recap. So. I have the Liverpool um, black skinny jeans. They are cute, they are comfy, they are black, which like I don't really have, like I have one other pair of black skinny jeans. I don't exactly love them because they don't stay up well. Um, and they are, but these ones are $78. So, but the good thing about them, this is where I have to justify stuff, is 
think I could wear them all year, right? Like, because you can wear them in the summer, you can wear them in the fall, you can wear them in the winter with skinny jeans, or you could wear them with knee-high boots, you could wear them with ballet flats, you could wear them with ankle boots. You could just wear them. But they're $78. So, uh, then is the Octavia um, Double Zip Work Satchel. Um, I like it. It cost $58, though. I guess I never really, like, modeled it. I really modeled it. Here it is one more time. Um, it's just a cute, like, burgundy bag with a gold zipper. It's very folly. Um, it has the middle pocket. I mean, it's cute. And then it has a strap to make it longer if you need it. But it's $58. Mm, the next was the poncho. You guys, I want to love ponchos. Like, they're so cute on everyone else. So I don't know, like, is it just something that I need to get over and give it a shot? Or am I right? And it makes me look, like, super bulky. And it was $64. Then there's this cowl neck shirt, which is ink love and peace. Um, oh my gosh. I love it. But... <laughs> I forgot that it cost $64. Which is kind of a lot for just a pullover shirt, right? Help me! Help me! Um, and last was the pink clover gray top with the sleeves detail, um, and it's $40. So my total for all five things is $304. Um, if I bought all, I would save 25%, which is $76, um, plus I already paid $20 for a styling fee, so that's taken off. So if I kept all five things, the total would be $208 for five things. So that makes it more justifiable in my mind. My husband never agrees with this logic, <laughs> but... Like, keep it all, you save a lot, and then it seems worth it. But, like, do I love the poncho? I don't know. And same with the bag, like, it's cute, but do I really need it? I don't know. So, I really like the jeans and this shirt for sure. But right there, that's 78 and 64. So, I mean, that's almost the whole amount of all five, right? Okay, so I really need your guys' help. So, help me, please. All right, guys. Thanks for tuning in. Um, please like and subscribe if you like hanging out. I will share the link to the Stitch Fix if you want to give it a shot. Um, it's totally worth it. I've had a lot of great fixes. Um, and like this one, it was just, it was great. But I just don't know. I don't even know what I'm looking for. That's probably the problem, right? Like, you have to know what you're looking for. I just want to be trendy in Wyoming. All right, guys. Have a great rest of your week, and I will see you all soon.